Hi, my name is Pete Simonini. I'm the new women's soccer coach here at Plymouth State University. So when I got done playing professional soccer, I landed the head men's soccer job at Bentley University where I started in 1987 and coached there until 2007. But during that time, I was also one of the assistant coaches for the New England Revolution when the league started in 1996. So my career kind of started here at Plymouth State um, and I played four years here. We had very good teams and during my time we set the NCAA record for career shutouts and in uh, my senior year I was drafted by a team in the North American Soccer League called the New England T-Men. I was the second player picked in the draft. So I left school early to pursue my professional career, which lasted until I got the job basically at Bentley. And um, so that was pretty cool. I think there's a couple. Obviously, being drafted was a pretty big memory. Um, and getting to play against some of the greatest players that ever played, Pelé, George Bass, Johan Cruyff, all those players, to getting to travel all over the world, obviously, and having the opportunity to make a lot of good friends. But another big accomplishment for me was being named one of the top all-time greatest players, top 50 greatest players from New England. Well, I think I like to build a program where it's, it's being respected by not only the, in, the, in the community here, but outside amongst all the peers that you would be, the teams that you'll be playing. I want the girls to have fun. I want them to, to enjoy themselves, to look forward to coming down, basically to have a great experience and hopefully their teammates would be friends for life. Well, I used to like to fish a lot. Uh, and um, I like going to sporting events. I'm a big sports guy. So I have season tickets to the Red Sox. And so I go to a lot of events in Boston. That's kind of what it is. Now that I've gotten older, um, I used to hike and stuff. But now, but now I just spend time basically driving my son, who's 15, who's basically one of the top Irish step dancers in this region and worldly, but also he is in um, the Boston Ballet professional program. I would probably look to be a midfield player just because I think I know the game and you can kind of dictate what's going on and be a facilitator. Um, I, think, I think the favorite part of New England is basically is all the cultural things that are here, especially in the city, um, but also you get all the four seasonal changes. You know, you get to, you get to experience things. You know, like when I was living in Florida, because when the team moved there, it was, you know, constant the same. It might have got a little, get a little cold once in a while, but it was hot. And so, but you never, never got to experience anything like the mountains and you go to those. From here, you know, in an hour you can be in, you know, in the mountains, you could be in the ocean, you could, you know, be in the city. There's different things. So that's what I like about New England. The most rewarding part for me is building the relationships with all the students, with the athletes uh, on my team and outside of my team. I think it's, it's good because you, I think you brought something to them and they appreciate it. And I think it was very, the relationships that I made with all those players. I still get 
you know, emails and text messages from numerous kids that I, the first year I was coaching to now. So, so that's rewarding for me.